Hey there, welcome back to Crypto Clarity. My name is Andrew. If you're here, it's because you're just looking for a simple and easy resource to learn more about cryptocurrencies. If you're like me, you're seeing this blow up all over the world and you wanna learn more about it. But when starting to do the research on your own, you realize it's like learning a whole nother language. It gets very overwhelming very quickly and it's easy just to give up and say, hey, this thing might blow over. I think this is here to stay and I wanna build you a base knowledge by just a couple minutes of a day breaking down a term or a concept to really gain your confidence and learn more about this. So no investment advice here. We're not doing any technical analysis. Uh, we don't wanna overwhelm you. We just wanna break down some easy terms and build that base knowledge. So today we're gonna break down the term HODL or HODL. So there's a couple different ways or uh, there's a debate on how that's pronounced but uh, the term is H-O-D-L, which you've probably seen all over the place and wonder what that means. Well, it's actually really simple. HODL or HODL means to hold. So if you, depending on your philosophy with Bitcoin, if you think this is gonna go up in value, then you are considered a HODLer and that you are just gonna hold that, you're gonna let the value of that run up rather than spend it on a day-to-day -day, you know, transaction. So. Some of the most famous hodls or hodlers um, are the Winklevoss twins. They famously were the uh, creators or alleged creators of Facebook before Mark Zuckerberg kind of kicked them out and went running with, uh, with Facebook. There was that famous lawsuit where they were paid, I believe over $60 million for their initial creation of Facebook. And since then they have really got into cryptocurrencies and they are the most famous Bitcoin hodlers or hodlers and uh, have been evangelizing it ever since. So I believe that they are the first Bitcoin billionaires because of this. And they say it's been the hardest job because the swings of Bitcoin have been so severe from, you know, there's now sitting at $50,000, but a year ago it was sitting at about $3,000 and it's made big, big swings over the last 10 to 12 years. So uh, that's all that means. It's a very simple term. Uh, but on my next video, we're going to break down another term. So we'll see you on the next one. Thanks a lot.